All right, so we're gonna make this airplane right here. And to start off, I need a piece of paper. I have a pattern for my spar base right there. I'm gonna glue that in, in place. Crazy glue it. Get our glue in there quickly. We're there, spar base plate. Right on top of those lines, lined up. We're good there. Now we're gonna glue spars in place. I have lines for those spars. I'm gonna press them down. And our spars are in place, just like that. A little bit of crazy glue at the base. Get these guys in position. That one's raised up a little bit. I'll hold it down for a second. The rest of them are in good shape. That there. Crazy glue right at the base here. That's done like so. I'll be putting on some pennies. Pennies are going to go here and here. Right there. Right there. Right there. Right there. A little more glue right on the edges here. Make sure these guys get glued down properly. And avoid getting the crazy glue on yourself. All right, one penny right up front here. This will be a little bit more forwards. It's gonna sit there, but not so that it goes beyond the end of the spars there. All right, let that sit now. We take one, two, three post-its. We'll fold our post-its. There's the sticky part right there. You want to identify the sticky part. We're going to fold it in half like so. Do that three times. Sticky side out. Sticky side out. Now I'm going to overlap the sticky side there, the sticky side here. Line these all up. And now have something that looks like this. Connect that together there. So now I have the shape of this T. All right. Grab some tape in this case. Tape the loose ends together. Sticky sides right here. There's another sticky side, loose end right there. Fold that over. There's the last edge right there. Fold that over. So we're good like that. Let that sit. Come back to our thing here. On my diagram, I have a bunch of V's. It's our center line. The 14th V from the line up is where I'm going to cut my piece of paper short. So I come over to our cutter. Or cut right there. All right. Now, important part, put glue on top of our spars. that more into our viewing screen right here. And then I'm gonna put glue right beyond, right by that dotted line at the base of the spars. I'm gonna fold this over and push down 
and move it forwards so that it is forming our wing. There is our wing right there, and our wing is almost done. The overlap spec part is right here. I can figure out where those end of the spars are. Right there. And I'm going to cut right about an eighth of an inch beyond those spars. All right, there we are. We have a wing. We have our tail fins. Now, I grab our dowel and pointy end towards you. Pointy ends of the dowels go forward. That side here is flat. Put that in between. And we're going to, on one side, put a longer piece of tape that is just covering the two bigger dowels. It doesn't need to touch and shouldn't touch the small shish kebab dowel in the, in the middle. And now I'm going to put a much smaller piece of tape in the center here. This should be, allow me to be able to move the dowel or the shish kebab stick up and down. Now with a side that has a short piece of tape, I have some bare wood. So I'm going to get my wing again, which is right here, flip it upside down to the, the bottom of my wing. I'm going to put crazy glue there and here. Getting the crazy glue just on the dowels and not on the shish kebab stick. And both sides of uh, our base of the wing here. And probably easiest to do it like so. Get that lined up with that. I still want to be able to move the um, shish kebab stick up and down through the two other dowels. That part is done. We come back to here. So this is the sticky side. That's not the sticky side. You can see they're kind of loose there. And the sticky side, we're going to put the point right into the place where they all meet together. And we're going to drive it in about halfway, uh, maybe three quarters of the way in to there. I'm going to come back here and try to make sure I get those parts here taped together. Now, I'll turn it this way. I am going to put some glue there in my tail fin. Tail fin is flat, wings are flat. The only thing that's still loose is this part right here. So, now the important part for me to do is figure out about where my center of gravity is, which is probably somewhere, looks like it's right about. So, well, I can do this right about there. So I got to balance my finger. That is perfect. Just where I want it to be. I'm going to hold that in place. I got my wing there. Hold it back here. Come in with our crazy glue. Final thing. And now at this point, I feel good and confident about gluing the dowel and the shish kebab stick together. So get some glue in there. Go through there. Um, Put this on a piece of paper. Those are our written directions that are on the computer. And we're going to set it upside down so that I know my tail fin's flat. Otherwise, the plane is ready to go. There is the plane right there. It should be ready to fly, and we'll give it a fly. That is it, and I thank you.